Hi, um, I'm gonna talk about The Letter to Ma by Merle Wu. And before introducing the text, first a few details about the author. He, she born in 1941. Uh, his mother uh, is Korean and his father is Chinese. Uh, she grew up in San Francisco and she is a writer and teach at the University of California, Berkeley. He rolled as a defender of the rights of women and minorities as well as the LGBT community its her readings across borders. Uh, well, the text can be divided into three sections. The first is the talk, uh, when the voice of the author engaging in an inner talk with his mother, uh, where she resorts to previous events of their talks to vent her frustration. Uh, the second part, uh, Yellow Woman Speaks. Um, and she tells her profession that uh, her need to give a voice to minorities, to let them see that they are not alone, that they can do it, but that her mother doesn't want to understand this. Despite understanding her place as a nation intruding among Caucasian people, the other explain and shines shines a very important word, yellow woman speaks, where they expose all the injustices of third parties with privilege where they try to subordinate their actions in simple absurd demonstrations. In the third part, the catharsis arises, the author reveals the real reason why her lighting are directed towards her and her father because since she was she saw them growing up she knew that people made the laces without any reason she understand that the huge hater that american people could feel for foreigners and her shame was more due to the way her parents did nothing she determined that they deserve belly that they always deserve that belly and that she could give it back she just needed them to be aware of it's too hard that their struggle will grow and stop behind something silly that few people saw. And the tone of this letter is not complaint, it is a sentences where she determines her part and where she plays for the support of those she loves the most because it is for the is for them. And well, I was really excited uh, to read this author because her words are not weak and her argumentation is so powerful, forceful, because she knows her ballad but without the trick. She betrayed. from any others and uh, what I like the most is is the fact so that she was not afraid to stand up the woman themselves because according to the community to the community she will be anti sorority and base but based on her fight for the equality of the yellow races and the gay community I I believe that my leading will fight for the justice for transsexual people, those who feel they are the wrong body and are punished for it as as if they were mentally ill. And it is a struggle that crosses border because we know that something like that is not the same seen here is in Asia, uh, in the Oriental. And their conservative uh, thinking induced that people who feel differently uh, can speak out or find of their body. And I think it is a worried issue that the Asian culture cha chains and hides. Um, if, if we're to use that to classrooms, uh, it would be a boom like due to the mission missions formation and lack of tact uh, 
that is given of literature of this type, um, literature, what doesn't use it to the minority because we have a lot of white male literature that pretends justice. So it is these Benjamins will be ignored, ignored in a short time. So we must endure as much as we can, um, hoping for a reasonable change and remolding those standards. Uh, something that I really appreciate about the university center where I am preparing for my future it is constant and stronger to be here as a community that promotes the human scenes. With marches, with events, and with a world to never leave artists that make makes us die. For example, in the Biennale that took place recently and I go, uh, they have uh, the reminds to continue promotion reading because it is a way to transcendence in the world draw our literature expression we live or Mars. I believe that's something that should be done to encourage movements to promote justice for ministries. Uh, would be creation would be to create groups where we can remove those patriarchal and obsolete ideas that continue to change our thoughts and despite the fact uh, that there already are in it showed uh, it has to be a taboo in all of us.